Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another fun, fast Tinkercad tutorial. So let's get cracking. Friends, this is a project I shared a while ago with circles with evenly spaced holes. Real quickly, I'll show you how this went. And I just did Control D. I'm going to ungroup that, and I'm going to click on this. This pair, once I did Control D, rotates around its center. And if I go to, say, 45 degrees, which I can just follow these inside, when I let go and do Control D, it rotates around. It's really, really cool, but it is not the smartest way, and it also does not solve what a user just asked. So a user asked, how can I do it if there's not an even number where we had those spaced across? Friends, here is the solution. Type in array, A-R-R-A-Y, and find the circular array. When you bring out this beast, it has cool choices for objects. Of course, we want a circle. We pick the size. I'm going to say six, just for giggles. Got to press enter and give it time. And then the slick thing is we can just go down here to the radius. I'm going to say type in 20 and press enter, and let's see how close that gets. And we can just walk it in to the shape we want. I'm going to select those two, choose a line, and once again, choose middle and middle. And bingo, that would be a solution for that shape. But remember the user that asked me how to do it with an odd number of shapes? This is how you change it. Just make that seven, it regroups, and bam, spaces them just the way you want. I choose all of a sudden to put these at 16, press enter, snap. It goes exactly the way you want. Make it a hole, select the pair. Just for giggles, I'm going to hit L and choose a line because I had that one messed up. And now when I group, we have got a circle with evenly spaced holes. How cool is that? Really quickly, I want to say thanks to Kitchen Bricks for asking the question. It helps me a ton when you guys let me know what you need, and I learn cool things along the way as well. Friends, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, if you got a question, comment, or suggestion, add it down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a good